Wren has a selective, refined menu with big, unforgettable flavor. People from northern Michigan and beyond have been flocking to the Sutton's Bay restaurant for now for about three years now. 9 and 10's Lauren Scafidi takes us inside the kitchen for a taste and to explain the sweet story behind its name. I've got to admit, I already started digging into the appetizer a little bit, but we have plenty more entrees and desserts to show you here at Wren and Sutton's Bay. So let's go inside the kitchen. Try to keep the menu small and simple and do a handful of things well. Mm -hmm. um, there's definitely a handful of different influences. One of those influences at Wren in Sutton's Bay, owner Adam McMarlin's culinary curiosity. I never cooked octopus before and I wanted to. The octopus is tossed in the pressure cooker so it's tender to the tooth and plated perfectly. The texture of the octopus I really like, so it's firm but not chewy. Um, the spiciness of the chorizo kind of balances that brightness of the marinade for the octopus. Like lots of lemon, shallot, garlic, olive oil, and uh, some oregano. Really tangy, zesty, perfect right before an entree. Yeah, absolutely. Like the scallops. We want it to be balanced, so you've got a little bit of spicy curry, cauliflower, the richness from the um, parsnip, sweetness from the raisins, and um, the pistachios are also a little bit spicy. But yeah, it's all together, um, sort of an explosion of sensation in your mouth. Every great meal ends with dessert, of course. My dad makes like the best key lime pie in the world, but he won't give me the recipe. <laughs> Of course. And so we've been kind of missing it. Um, so we just kind of made our own version of that. Mm -hmm. Finished off with candied lime zest and some bee pollen. Super different. That's not something you see every day. Family was the inspiration for the restaurant's name, too, coming from his second daughter. Her middle name was Ren. So I thought that would be cute to name it after one of my kids, and also it gave us like a, a logo. Wrens are a migratory bird. So they come up here and go down south, but um, kind of like a lot of people here. But they'll always have a home here in Sutton's Bay. Inside the kitchen at Wren, I'm Lauren Scafidi. And if there's a restaurant you'd like to see featured, we'd love to hear from you. Send us an email to InsideTheKitchen at 9and10news.com.